In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up your Moza R5 bundle. To download the PitHouse software, you have to go to mozaracing.com, then go to support, scroll down, go to download center and download the PitHouse. So after you start the Moza PitHouse, turn on your wheelbase and you should see this screen. Here you have your wheel where you can set your steering angle, your base with the game force feedback intensity. I have it on 100% and work mode is on. Here you have your pedals and we will go back to them because you have to calibrate them first. But the first thing you should do is to go to that small cloud tab and check if your firmware is up to date. If it's not, it will show you that you are running the old firmware. You can one click to upgrade all or check for updates, but you can also do it separately if you have a different wheel rim or handbrake or shifter and you can choose the firmware you want. You can even try a beta version and if you don't like some version of firmware, you can go back as well. So the next step is your wheelbase. I have covered how to set up force feedback in previous videos, so you can go and check it out. The second one is your wheel rim. Here you can uh, set up the brightness of the LEDs and your RPM lights. I usually run the default settings here uh, because you cannot change colors on this wheel rim. And I think the settings uh, for RPM are pretty on point. But you can play with timing. If you feel that your RPMs are reaching limit too fast, you can change the timing. Like uh, you can put it on late, but I have it on normal. You can also customize the timing by yourself by adjusting these sliders. The interval is how fast the lights will blink at the end. The next very important thing you should do is go to the tab with the little fella, go to reset and calibration and you should calibrate your wheelbase. Hit the start button for wheelbase reset and calibrate and follow the instructions on the screen. After you calibrate your wheelbase, go to the pedal tab and calibrate your pedals. Scroll down a little bit and hit start calibration. Start the calibration press the pedal a few times and you can wait for the countdown or you can end the calibration by yourself and the calibration is complete and the last thing you can go again to this little fella go to experimental function and here you can see that your pit house will be downloading only the released versions of the firmware it is also the released version of the pit house but if you want to try for example beta versions that moza sometimes release on their discord channel they will give you code that you have to write here and confirm and after that Moza Pithouse will be downloading the beta version, but I recommend to leave this screen and use only the released versions of the firmware and the Pithouse. I hope you like this video and I will see you in the next one.